cloud right across the country, and that was due to this warm front over Northern Ireland, Wales, down into Southern England. The weather was different on either side of it. A lot of cloud and mist in the southwest, but bright and drier over in Carlisle, although temperatures similar up around 13 degrees. Now that warm front has ground to a standstill over southern parts of the country, but this cold front here is going to be moving eastwards during the course of tonight and again tomorrow, bringing a lot of cloud and some further outbreaks of rain with it. This evening we've still got that warm front giving us some cloud and outbreaks of light rain and drizzle in many western areas. That will continue to move northwards in northern areas, with this cold front also pushing in from the west during the course of the night. But down the eastern side of the country, it is going to remain dry there, and with those cloud breaks, it does look as though we're going to see a touch of ground frost. But meanwhile, down in the south and over many western areas, a good deal of cloud and patchy mist with fog over hills and coasts, with further light rain and drizzle from time to time. Here, quite a mild night, temperatures as high as 9 degrees in Wales, but further east, we are going to see temperatures around 2, up to around freezing in parts of eastern Scotland. Well, for tomorrow, it does look as though this warm front will be moving just a little bit further eastwards, a lot of warm air over Wales and England and Northern Ireland, this cold front pushing in all the time during the course of tomorrow, a lot of cloud on it, some outbreaks of rain, reaching many western parts of the country during the course of the afternoon. But it will be dry and brighter down through eastern Scotland, eastern England, and we may even see some sunshine in East Anglia and South East England. Temperatures, though, generally around what they were today, around 8 in the east, quite cool with the wind coming in from the southeast during the course of the day, blowing off a chilly North Sea. And really by the end of the day, it's going to be once still pushing a little bit slowly eastwards, a lot of cloud around them and this area of low pressure to the southwest. And it's going to be a lot of cloud right across the country, some further outbreaks of rain in many places, and coming cooler later. And it's unlikely we'll see temperatures as high.